Welcome back. <laughs> oh, <look>, come on. <laughs> oh. You can't hold you, mama. Hi, guys. Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 21. Anyways, the reason why we're here is I have a bunch of favorites that I wanted to share with you guys. I have a bunch of stuff, all different price tags on it. I have some drugstore items. I have skincare. I have makeup. I have lashes. I have a purse. I have a bunch of different stuff that I want to share with you guys. Um, let me know. Also, let me know if you guys are still interested in favorites videos because I know that personally I love watching favorites videos I think they're like some of the best videos just because I'm always interested in trying new products and what's better than like seeing other people's opinions on products in favorites videos so I love them but let me know if you guys are like over it or if you don't really care just let me know how you feel um but I am going to jump right in to the favorites video and also I feel like now is like the perfect time to talk about favorites things in case you guys are looking for like last minute gift items for anybody in your life um you know you could probably get something from this video. So the first thing I'm gonna talk about is my Teddy Blake purse. It is seriously so freaking cute. Look how cute it is. So it's like this beautiful light beige Italian premium leather bag. Um, it does have like a crocodile skin pattern to it. Down here it says Teddy Blake New York. Um, it has, this is like the closure right here. So you prop these open and then flip the flap and then your bag is open it's just so freaking cute and stunning and I just I'm obsessed with it um you can carry it like this or you can carry it on the shoulder strap I personally always go hands-free and use a shoulder strap just because it's easier when you're running errands and stuff to use a shoulder strap this is detachable too though if you didn't want to use a shoulder strap you could just take it off the back does have a nice big pocket here so in case you want to like store your phone or your keys or whatever you want to you can it's a deep pocket like my hands all the way down here um, so you can store your keys, your phone, whatever for easy accessibility. And yeah, it also says Teddy Blake back here as well. Um, so unfortunately, if you guys are vegan, I apologize. This is real leather. Um, that being said though, it is a gorgeous real leather. Like the feel of it is just so buttery. You can smell it. It smells like really amazing quality. Like I can smell the leather like right here. <laughs> and obviously I'm close to the bag, but like I can smell the leather as soon as I walk in the room because I have the bag out. It's not overpowering. It just smells like a nice premium Italian like leather. Um, so if that's something that's important to you, I definitely would recommend this bag. So Teddy Blake offers a bunch of different sizes and designs for their bags. They have bigger bags. They have smaller bags. They have all different types of styles, like literally something for everyone. And also right now they're having really great Christmas sales up to 85% off. So if you ever wanted to get yourself a really amazing designer bag, but not at the price point, check out Teddy Blake because like I said, they're having great sales. And honestly, the quality, quality of this is unmatched. Also, one more thing about Teddy Blake. I just wanna mention this one more time because I truly do love this brand. I truly do love these bags. I have another one of Teddy Blake's bags. It's a black one um, with gold detailing. It's beautiful. It's still in pristine condition. I've got it, I think I got it two years ago. It is stunning. This is stunning. It's just a great little bag. Like it's amazing. Also. If you, like I said, if you've ever wanted like a designer bag but didn't want to spend the one to two thousand and up price tags, Teddy Blake is a great designer for you. You won't be spending a fraction of that price. Their bags are of the highest quality. They do make these bags in the same factories that they do make other designer bags in, but yet you're getting a premium Italian leather bag at a fraction of those price tags. So again, check out Teddy Blake. I will leave everything you need to know in the description box down below. Um, and yeah, okay, moving on. <laughs> okay, the next thing I wanna talk about is, let's do makeup first. Um, so the next thing is actually an e.l.f. brand product. I picked this up at my local Target. It is the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. It looks like this, let me show you. It's like, it literally looks like a balm or like a putty. Um, and it feels like that as well. It's very, very soft. So why I like this, I like this in conjunction with the product, but I have used this on its own and it's really good. It does smooth out my pores. It definitely keeps my makeup on a longer. Now I'm not somebody who has oily skin, so I can't tell you if it's good for like oily skin. Um, and I don't know if it helps with like oil control or anything like that. Cause again, I just don't have oily skin, but I do have dry skin and this definitely does look amazing on my skin. So I like to use that this in conjunction with the milk 
Hydro Grip Primer, which looks like this. This is the little travel size. I picked this little guy up just to try it, just to see if like it was worth all the hype and 100% it is when I use these together. So this doesn't smooth out my pores on its own, which is why I'll use this with it to smooth out my pores. Um, but this does keep my makeup on forever. Like, and you guys have seen that if you watched Vlogmas, I literally will, and this is not the best habit in the world, okay? But I will sleep in my makeup sometimes, um, and I'll wake up in the morning and my face still looks good. I totally give all the credit to these two primers right here. Um, the Milk Hydro and the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. Bomb. And of course I'm going to talk about some lip products. I think lipsticks are just like one of my favorite things ever. Uh, so the first one is the one I'm wearing right now, which is a really pretty like warm brown nude shade. This is by IBY Beauty. I did receive this in a BoxyCharm box. It's in the shade Nude and it... I dropped it. <laughs> and it's just a beautiful, beautiful shade. Like it's stunning. It looks gorgeous on the lips it's long wearing i've worn this all day and i did have to touch up at the end of the night though so and it only wore off like in the middle of my lips so 100% love this 100% recommend this ibi beauty shade nude everything that you guys see i will try to link in the description box as well for you guys um another one that's very similar in shade to that if you can see it's just a little bit more warm toned um, is the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in the shade Ashton. This has been a go-to for me, especially during this season. It is just stunning. I always get compliments when I wear this lipstick. Even my boyfriend complimented on this lipstick and like, when does a man ever notice a lipstick color? <laughs> so it's a really good one. It's stunning. I actually picked this up at TJ Maxx and I bought a backup. That's how much I love it. Um, so yeah, if you can find this at TJ Maxx or even at Sephora, pick it up. It is bomb. It is a beautiful color. I'll swatch it for you because I don't have it on. It's just a really pretty warm nude shade. Like that's just stunning. It's just so like fall and winter. It's just beautiful. And then to go along with it, I've been using the MAC Pro Longwear Lip Pencil in the shade Nice and Spicy. And it looks like that. And it's just a perfect color to go right along with those liquid lipsticks. So I'll swatch this as well. MAC Pro Longwear Lip Pencils are one of my absolute favorite lip liners. They are just beautiful. They're creamy. They stay all day. They are amazing. You can even like wear the lip liner itself as a lipstick. I've done that before. Like filled in all of my lips with the lip liner. Back when I was obsessed with MAC Pro Lip MAC Pro Lip Liner in the shade Morning Coffee. I literally would fill all of my lips in with that and dab like a, a light, light nude shade in the center. And that would be everything that I wore. That'd be it. And it was, it stayed all day. It was amazing. So if you haven't tried MAC Pro Longwear Lip Pencils yet, I highly, highly suggest them. They are bomb. Now the lashes, you guys know that I gave up eyelash extensions a couple of months ago and I've been giving them a break, my eyelashes at least. And to be honest with you, I don't know if I'm ever going to go back. Like I've just been having so much fun wearing lashes. I feel like you can switch up your look that way and just change the shape of your eye. I love them. Um, the ones that I've been wearing lately, which you guys always comment on, are from Amazon. And I have mentioned these before, but I figured that it was important to mention them again because they are so good and affordable. They are from, again, from Amazon, professional last goose they are a faux mink style they have a million this brand has a million different styles for you to choose from this one is an a06 um it's down here if you can see that there a06 i've tried a couple different styles and they're all amazing i can have these lashes on all night i reuse them up to like 15 times and so like 10 or 12 dollars for five pairs and again i can get multiple multiple uses out of one pair like I would say probably 10 to 15 wears out of one single pair so yes check these out if you like lashes and you like the faux mink look I will leave these again listed in the description box down below okay so the next couple products I'm going to talk about are skincare um I am going to mention my Laneige lip sleeping mask again I've mentioned this in previous videos and get ready with me is in favorites I am obsessed with this lip mask it is so hydrating and so moisturizing. It feels amazing on the lips. Um, it looks like this. They have several different flavors. I mean, you know, not flavors, but scents. You can't eat it. I mean, you can, but. <laughs> um, and I have basically used up almost all of mine. I have a couple more uses in there, but it is just so good. 
I absolutely love this and it's 100% worth the $20 price tag. I will definitely be repurchasing this. All right, and the last thing I wanna talk about is skincare. Now, skincare is something that I've kind of fallen out of love with. I just wasn't excited by anything except the ordinary stuff. Um, I did wanna try a bunch of the Drunk Elephant products and a lot of people were saying that Drunk Elephant Certain products were comparable to the ordinary, and so that's kind of why I went towards the ordinary because Drunk Elephant has a really expensive price tag, and I don't know about you guys, but I cannot afford to just drop $90 on one product. So I went to the ordinary. Um, I did order this off of Sephora.com during the VIB sale, so I believe I got like 10 or 15% off. But even so, everything by itself is, I believe, under $10. Every single thing I'll be showing you. Uh, so the first thing I'll talk about is the Ordinary Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. This is really great. Again, I've mentioned that I do have dry skin and this does not dry me out too badly. I use this at night after I wash my face. I'll just take a cotton round and just go over my face a little bit. And the purpose of this toner is just to kind of shrink your pores a little bit. Uh, it's a glycolic acid solution. So it's just a really great product. Again, I only use this once a day and I use this at night. And then the next couple things I have here are uh, the Ordinary Caffeine Solution 5% plus EGCG. So this is for your under eyes. If you have dark circles, if you have hyperpigmentation, if you have bags, you will want to try this product. Honestly, I have seen a pretty good amount of improvement in the color of my dark circles. I feel like they're not as intense as they once were. I do have tea bag stained eyelids. So all around my eye right here, it's like that raccoon eye is a different shade than the rest of my face. It's, it's basically like a darker shade of brown, um, dark circles. My face is pretty pale. And then I do have, again, like, like inside this little area right here is dark, down here and above the lid. Um, but that being said, I do apply this twice a day underneath my eye right here and also on the eyelid on top and I have seen a difference. I believe this is under $10 as well. Everything comes in a glass bottle with a little dropper applicator. So it looks like that. Um, and I just use a couple of drops and rub it in. It sinks in super quickly and I just move on. It's just bomb. I highly recommend this. I, if you have dark circles or under eye bags, you're gonna wanna try this product. It's really good. The next thing I have here is called the Buffet. It's a multi-technology peptide serum. Peptides are really great for the skin, anti-aging problems, as well as pore issues. Um, it's really great. So you can use this twice a day. And I do use it twice a day. I just use a couple of drops, as you can see. Um, it's like right here on the bottle, but it's really good. I really, I really do like this stuff. Uh, I haven't really, I haven't really noticed any difference in wrinkles or like fine lines or anything, but I do notice like the overall texture and tone of my skin looks better and I can only attribute it to these products. Now, one thing I will say with the ordinary is you do have to be careful because not all products can go together. Um, so I would say if you are gonna order some products, you're gonna wanna do your research, you're gonna wanna type in Google, like can I use this with this? Because they do have like acids and um, just different things that can't exactly go together because they can cause irritation for your skin. So definitely do your research if you're gonna order any of the ordinary products. They do have a good description online as far as like on their website of what to use, great cocktails, things like that, so it is helpful. Um, everything that I'm showing you can be used together and I did do my research on that. The last thing I have from The Ordinary is called the Grin Active Retinoid 2% Emulsion. Again, this is something that's really great to use for anti-aging qualities and properties. It's just really, really good. But that's all I have to show you guys today. If you're interested in any of these products, I will leave them in the description box down below for you guys. I love you all so, so much. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.